Hey DSMS, it's Kayla. And Damien with your April 10th edition of DSMS TV News. Tomorrow's leadership club meeting is canceled. There is a girls basketball home game tomorrow at 4.30 for 7th graders and 5.30 for 8th graders. Come and support your fellow students. The so there is a soccer and basketball practice today. Also wrestling practice. Now to an important announcement with Mr. Osberg and Mr. Hummer. Good morning, Desert Shadows Middle School. Hard to believe this is our first week of AZ Merit testing. On Thursday of this week, we'll have a writing assessment in AZ Merit. We're going to share some details this morning about what that means. Uh, I would like us all to get off to a serious, focused, and prepared start to our AZ Merit testing. I'm going to talk to you a little bit about the importance of the AZ Merit testing. The AZ Merit is one of the few tests that is consistent and will show long-term progress over your educational career, K-12. You'll be taking an AZ Merit test of the same form and fashion um, in your senior year in high school as you're taking as a seventh grader or even as a third grader. Um, I brought with me to the news studio a CUM folder. All of you students have a CUM folder uh, that will move with you from middle school and on to high school. And inside your CUME folder are artifacts related to grades, student discipline, and uh, your state standardized tests. So inside the one I have here has, uh, this is an eighth grade CUME folder, and it belongs to a student here. And inside here is a second grade Stanford test that, that um, it, let's see, it's from 2011. And behind that, are the AIMS testing that this student took as a third grader and fourth grader, and more recently, those AZ merit tests. So because the student is gonna take the same test for seven or eight years, uh, we're gonna be able to look at that student's improvement over time. That is, if we have our best effort from our students. This is another encouragement for you to do your very best so that we can compare your results as a seventh grader or an eighth grader, and on through your high school experience. Your results will tell a story, and we hope that it will show your best work and best effort. With that, I'm going to turn it over to Mr. Rosenberg for some more details about our week or weeks of testing. Great. Thank you, Mr. Hummert. So, this Thursday, you're going to take your writing section of the AZ Merit. Next week, on Tuesday and Wednesday, we will have the ELA portion along with the math portion. On these days, we'll be on a modified bell schedule. We'll be testing in the morning and then having shortened classes after lunchtime. Teachers, please post the bell schedule in your room and make sure you go over with the students so they know what to expect. Students, it is important to be ready on test days. Some ways you can make sure you have a good testing experience, make sure you are well rested, make sure you eat a good breakfast the morning of the test, and of course, please make sure you are here at school. Students, on testing days, please make sure you bring earbuds if you have them, since there are portions of the test that will allow you to use them. Please remember to bring a book to read for when you are finished testing. And remember, there are no electronics allowed during testing. This includes smartwatches. All phones must be powered down to help us with our bandwidth during testing. Testing rooms will be posted on the Media Center window Tuesday morning. Please make sure you check to see what room you will be testing in. If you have any questions about where you will test or don't see your name on the list, please come see me. That's it for now. There'll be more testing information in the next few days. Have a great day, Desert Shadows. Now that the birthday's of Pablo. Hey, DSM Rats, it's Pablo with the birthdays. Today's birthdays are James Cole Duff, Christian Finical, Maggie Pardswick, Sophie Spinnacle, and Haley Coates, and Zachary Wicks. That's all in the Back to the Anchors. We're, We're back. back. Attention all NJHS students. There will be a very important meeting for the NJHS this coming Wednesday at 2.50 to 3.45 in room C1. We will be planning our final trip to the nursing home. Also, this is a mandatory meeting for those attending our California trip. We will decide on meal choices and receive detailed information about the trip. Please be prompt. Any questions? Please see Ms. Haltino in room A4 as soon as possible. That's all for today, DSMS. Have a great Monday.